Hello good people from the YouTube, here's Marcel Durer once again and today we're going to try out this uh, pedal which is the TC Electronics uh, GIMS 45 which is basically a JCM, uh, uh, well you know the Marshall 45. Uh, this pedal is digital and I normally use Joyos, okay? So something like, uh, you know, the. Well, I don't have one here, wait. Normally it's something like this, okay, uh, or the Marshall version I don't have, but I used to have. Uh, I have this AC tone, which is a Vox. I use the, um, on my pedal board now, I have the, the American sound, which is Fender, and I have a Mesa Boogie California sound on my gigging pedal board. And I've been using these for a long time, but then when I saw this, I thought, you know what? This sounds like it's going to be way better than my Joyo's, and it has all the qualities that I need that the Joyo has, plus... A headphone jack out <laughs> on this side so I thought okay I'm gonna give this a try and I don't want to be too biased because I've been using the joys for a long time and it's hard to change you know it's really hard to change the quality of this is better than the joys but it does not work for me okay this on headphones sounds much better than the joys but sounds like a plug-in in my opinion if you want to take for a gig, then you have the plug-in in a pedal compact uh, format, which is really nice, but then it has to sound better than the Joyo. And for my sake, it does not. And I'm saying this right from the bat, because if you hear my opinions down while we're doing the sound test, uh, you might think, oh, he's biased, he likes the, the crappy Joyo Chinese thing. Well, the crappy Chinese thing has been holding on for me for over 10 years, and it's... Um, Although it's based on the Sans Amp though. I had a Sans Amp, I compared it and I still prefer the Joyo. But maybe it's just my ears, maybe I'm, I'm, I'm stupid. But here's the thing. I tried these and with the out, the direct out sounds like you're plugging in line. It's horrible. But when you do use the cab sim, then things start getting interesting. And then it sounds really, really nice. But when it goes from that to an actual speaker cabinet, then the Joyo has a more direct sound and more full sound than this. And that's why for me playing live, I prefer the Joyo than this. This would be something to have at home to plug really quick and play and start doing demos. But then again, if I'm going to do that at home, I can use a plug-in. Said that, let's go for the, for the, um, uh, the sound samples, right? Okay, let's go. Okay, now I got the pedal here set up. I got this Tube Screamer-ish pedal here. I got this uh, Big Muff. Um, kind of Russian big muff type. Got all these other effects, but I'm not gonna. I'm gonna con concentrate more on the distortion ones. And we got this uh, Amuse, which is basically a Joyo American sound. It's the same. If you open, you know it's a Joyo made. But I need to. I'm gonna use this to compare it to that one. Even though this is a Fender, that's a Marshall. I don't have a Marshall version of these. But I wanted to compare the qualities. Uh, I can already tell the quality of this one is better. But from maybe not for me. But anyway, we'll see. Um, one thing that I'd like to address really quick is the fact that when you press on on this thing, uh, after powering it up with your daisy chain, it will give you a boom, a big hit in the ears. If you're wearing headphones, it happened to me. It was ringing for an hour. I was really uh, annoyed. <laughs> My ears were feeling a bit we weird after. But anyway. So that's something that is already funny. I think this should be in an isolated power supply, like a, like not a daisy chain because it's a digital re, uh, pedal. And I don't have one of those bricks with ISO power for digital. So I recommend doing that because also uh, it brings a lot of noise in your chain if you mix analog and digital stuff like this. So with that out of the way, then we can listen to the first um, hit of the when you turn it on which doesn't sound much maybe on the video but in my ears was definitely annoying so it was something like this yeah doesn't sound like much now but trust me it happened and annoyed me a little bit but let's take that out of the way uh maybe it's my my problem that i am using daisy chain instead of an isolated power supply okay uh so now we are running here out of the back in and out and not using the SIM cap, okay? Why is that? Well, because we're actually using uh, MV50 Vox out of here, going to a cabinet, okay? And 
with that uh, AR from the from the Vox MV50 into my Pro Tools. I can bypass that and go directly in line later on for you guys to, but this is how I use my board most of the time and you know, it's how it works for me. I'm sure this unit will work very well for other people with different scenarios, but this is where I come, come across in my playing. I'm using a Stratocaster and let's get the first sound because I'm talking a lot. Sounds really good by itself. Um, no complaints on that. You get your boost. Which I'm set for post, so it's just increasing volume and it's not distorting the amp itself. But now let's put a drive on, on, on it. Okay, here's my first complaint, if you didn't hear that. At least going through the speaker here on the on in the room, it has that uh, digital distortion kind of sound that I hate it when it's overdriving the input and it's breaking up in here in the digital system. It just sounds like crap. I hate that sound, at least for me, which was a bummer when I first start using this pedal because the pedal itself has a really good sound. But once I boost with that, was was sounding a bit horrible in my opinion. Let me show you once again. Sounds I don't know. It sounds like you're plugging a line or something. But let me show you with the big muff. It's even worse. But anyway, the point is that it sounds like crap. And then guess what? Then we put the Joyo here. Cheap stuff, right? It's a little bit lower volume, but still. It sounds better to my ears, and this is not the configuration that I normally use. I'm just trying to match this one a little bit more because this one's way brighter and a little bit thinner. Usually I use this in a different configuration. I use it like this, roughly like this. Yeah, something like that. Let's try it again. Okay, at this point you're thinking, oh my god, uh, the Joyo sounds so much better. Well, guess what? Because the Joyo has apparently um, a very old school uh, cab simulator on his output. That is making it sound better because this one is going out as a line, which doesn't make much sense to me. But anyway, it's hitting the preamp of the Vox outside here really harsh. And it sounds like DI. So if we go here and we change that into the cab sim of the TC, now it's more like a fair, fair game. You know, technically now we're gonna sound better with the distortion and everything. Let's see again. <laughs> They are very, very different sounding because they're also like one is Fender, one is Marshall. Um, I'm going to try to make them sound a little bit closer again so we can do the, the sake of comparison. But let's do it. Uh,
can tell the quality is quite different. And this one, it does sound better than the Joyu. In the headphones, but in the room, not so much. This one is thicker, more direct. This one is thinner and sounds like a bit like a, like you're listening to a representation of an amp. And this just sounds like you listen to, to a real amp in the room. And maybe not even worth a comparison, but I actually preferred the Joyo from what I need to do, which is play live. This thing is really nice. If maybe if you want to record really quick a guitar and just need a sound. You just plug in directly. But then again, if you're going to use this, might as well use a plug-in, right? I don't know. It's just, uh, I thought it would be cool if I could use this live, but live, I'm preferring this one. When I say live, I mean going through the speaker cabinet. So let's do one more test now with the Big Muff. different I need to adjust this a little bit better <clears throat> let's try something here Hard to say. There's something. I, maybe I'm just more used to the Joyo, but the thing is that I thought I was going to use this to use the headphone outs into my in-ear system. And I was going to have you know this, and I'm going to ditch my boost, my actually TC boost pedal for this. But the end result is that I'm probably going to use the Joyo, keep the Joyo with me and return this because unfortunately for me, for me it doesn't work. Even though I recognize that it sounds, the quality of sound is really, really nice. I'm actually going to return it. Uh, I wanted to keep, I'm, I didn't get it just to do this video, but I thought I, I should do a video before I send it back. And I'm sure it will serve other people very well, but not me, unfortunately.
sounds more like an amp indeed in the headphones, but in the room it's just such a different <laughs> Now this is sounding like a toy, but <clears throat> let's try to make it a little bit more interesting. Well, you know, you guys can choose. This sounds really, really good, but not for me. I used this for many years, and I think I'm gonna stick with it for my gigs. And uh, yeah, that's it. So. Yeah, it's complicated. Taste is really good. It's not bad, but I might stick with those one for for life because if I want this for digital recordings and stuff, I can use plugins. It sounds it sounds similar to that. Uh, for live, I feel like this one has more punch, and even though this one on the headphone sounds better, it is what it is. Let's go back to the other camera. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed the review. Uh, Maybe I'm not being fair to this, maybe I should give her a longer try to the pedal. But like I said, for my purpose, I just, I thought this was going to blow the joy out of them, you know. But the reality is that it does not. It looks nicer, it looks cooler, it's metal. But I don't know, man, I'm not going to keep it. Because I have a boost pedal, TC boost pedal that I use after my joy that is exactly the function of this boost. I don't need channel switching for me. And because I use guitar, you know, I use a fuzz boxes and distortion boxes and overdrive so yeah kind of redundant for me unfortunately I'm gonna send it back I love TC products but I'm gonna send this back not because it's a bad pedal it's just it doesn't work for me it wasn't doing the function that I needed and uh, yeah that's it I hope you enjoyed the video uh, if you like if you're a big John Frusciante fan uh, I would recommend this pedal if you want to take some bedroom uh, sound with it you know, you got your John Frusciante sound here, but like I said, it's not for me. I use the Joyo uh, British sound if I want to get that sound. Okay, uh, for this demo, you're, you're listening to my Stratocaster, my Red, Fiesta Red, um, Custom Shop Fat 50s pickups, uh, Mexican parts, Strat, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed. There was not too many Frusciante licks on this video, but it will come soon because I'm getting a partnership with some pedal makers that does a lot of like these uh, John Frusciante pedals uh, handmade from Brazil. He's sending it over to me. He's the first guy actually supporting my channel. And I'm thrilled to have these. He's going to send me the Fuzz right and the, the Chorus Ensemble, the CE1. Yes, that's, that's the one that I wanted. And he's giving me the Fuzz right as a gift uh, on top of it. Like, they're both for free. He's giving me for free to try out. It's the first time my channel actually received uh, things to to try and to review for free. So I'm really, really pleased with that. Uh, this one, I bought it. So I'm sending it back and getting my money back. Uh, minus delivery. But anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this pedal, uh, this TC pedal works better for you. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you like the videos. There's way more Red Hot Chili Peppers stuff coming on if you're a John Frusciante fan. Uh, check out my band if you can, M-Files, just put hashtag M-Files band on here on, on YouTube or, or Spotify or uh, Instagram, whatever you, you like to use. Check out our music, uh, live videos here on YouTube too, live from Cat Space, it was, it was a nice show that we did recently. And uh, yeah, have a good time guys, peace, out, bye.